conduit! The light shall bring victory for Cosmodon! Against Priest, we will keep Acolyte Razor. Grom work well as a finisher. I don't think the deck needs a finisher. I think that the deck like has like value finisher primarily. You don't need like okay historian, huh? You wish to live forever. Oh, this is a very good, very good selection of tools we got right here. I don't need. I don't want to coin out the blood razor here. I don't think it's necessary. Mm -hmm. Um. We'll attack this. Next turn could potentially acolyte plus attack. Uh -huh. Hmm. Well, I can attack here if I want, and then sleep execute. It's kind of weak. I can also acolyte armor smith attack here. Eh, we only three, four. We can also coin. I think I'm gonna attack this sleep. So this clears everything, and this guy doesn't die to the the sleep there. I could have, I obviously could have played this first, but this way I can potentially get the three draws off of it. Oh no, I've mismatched armor smiths. I should really craft a gold armor smith. Yeah. This lets us save the potential execute for like something big off of Spiteful Summoner. Because it's looking like my opponent's playing. Well, actually, no, he has Powered Shield, so he probably doesn't have Spiteful Summoner. He has a Raza deck. Okay. That does change things. I actually totally blanked on the fact that, that he had played the Powered Shield, and I was thinking about him as a Spiteful Summoner deck. Alright. He's not potioning. Uh, we got a donation from Sorry for Joey Rock. He said, Hey man, don't know if you remember my donation a month ago. Doing better now. Thanks for being honest. I do remember, and I'm glad to hear you're doing better. Well, we can Armorsmith, Armorsmith, Drywhisker, Armorer, Whirlwind. We could also just Whirlwind Hero Power and not Armor. Because we end up. This gives us. F uh, yeah, this is fine. We're mostly trying to out armor him here. I think probably not attack. I wonder if it's correct for me to be playing this rather than armoring up. Because I end up gaining four from this now, two from these. So it's equivalent to this, but I'm, ga I'm definitely getting this. Whereas I still have one of the corner sentry in my deck. Cleric. Okay. A circle of healing or something? Spirit Lash. That gives me a lot of armor. Okay. Shield slam this guy. Ha, ah, my browser's back. Hooray! Yeah, we want two armor from this guy.
249. Ooh. That's funny. He can attack now. How has the deck been performing on the ladder lately? I have played like two games with it so far, so. Psychic screen. Okay. Well, I got this tower shield, which is probably the best thing I can get against uh, Priest. Okay, I don't have, actually have a way to kill this right now. Maybe I should have played the Acolyte last turn. I was like waiting to have something to pair it with, but because he hadn't pained me yet. I could Acolyte Brawl there, which obviously gives me a 50-50 of, win uh, of winning time. But I feel like I want to try and get cards from the Acolyte, because I'm actually fairly low on resources and he has a ton of cards. And I feel like the 8 damage here isn't huge. And I only, obviously also only have a 50-50 of the Brawl. Okay. It's going to be a much better potential Brawl result. Oh, that, that makes it even better. Anything but Alex. Oh, it's even the the armorer. He's a serious, serious thug of a of a kobold here. I'm saving the tower shield because he's not. I'm not in like burst range at the moment. And, like, him thinking that he can burn me out, and then me having 15 armor is pretty valuable. I'm keeping the Ravaging Ghoul at the moment because I have Execute and Sleep to both enable with it. The light has betrayed me. Mm. Eh, I'm just gonna do this now. Almost out of cards. We need to get him to commit stuff that we can remove with these. Because he, he obviously can't just like ping me out. He has to get things in the board, so we need to we need to hold these for the moment, I think. Blessed be this Ooh, oh baby. Alright. Can I get a 47 drop, please? It's not a 47 drop. It's close. I mean, it's about as big as you get, so... What's happening here? Did he steal a King Mosh or something? He's already played two stolen cards. Dragonfire. Okay. His long neck is still around, though. Oh, not anymore. Get in the way! Hold! I'm only at 62, so... I could just die at any moment, clearly. Okay, Kazakus is one of the things that's like, you know, obviously can produce a lot of board presence slash damage. I have both armor smiths that got shuffled into my deck. So, what are the things that he could have gotten? He still has silence left, right? So he could have silenced this and attacked if he has silence in his deck. Eh. Like, res and... I want to save this for if he, gets, if he has, like, a res plus damage or something. Sleep, I still gain two. This way, I gain three. And I still have this play. Thank you. 
Okay. Well. Still at 63. Memorial Drake, okay. Hey, what's in the box? Down to 61. And there's the profit. Silence that. Okay. Alright. He's going in. Going in. Do I play sentry into Garrosh? I can also just get... What am I talking about? I can also just garage attack and sleep with the fish and kill this. So what am I doing? Because this is obviously the only threat. For some reason, that the, just like... In my brain, was I was unable to kill this this turn. Well, that's not right. It's dead. Okay. He's, he's gonna get me. Two damage a turn. He's fatiguing for six. Okay. <laughs> armor. 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 It was all the Ultrasaur, really. 